India's historic second moon mission, the Indian Space Research Organization attempted a soft landing of its Vikram lander, but it ended prematurely when they lost communication with the craft. And now, in a tweet, U.S. space agency NASA confirmed that it has found Chandrayaan 2's Vikram lander. The tweet reads, Chandrayaan 2 Vikram lander has been found by our NASA moon mission orbiter. NASA's orbiter camera captured a high-resolution image that was released to the citizen scientists for analysis. A Chennai-based 33-year-old engineer, Shanmugam Subramanian, alerted NASA by showing the debris of the lander. He took to Twitter announcing NASA's acknowledgement of his discovery. NASA included colored dots to show the initial impact site of the lander as well as the debris field created by the crash. Yeah, so uh, NASA publicized this image on their blog on uh, uh, September 17. So after looking at NASA's blog and NASA's statement, they are not able to find it because it's hidden in shadows. I downloaded that 1.5 GB of image to my system, and I compared it side by side with the both old and new images of LRO. And I was able to find something that was out of ordinary in a particular spot. So I thought this might be the debris because it's something that's not there, that has not been seen in the previous images, whatever I have seen. So I tweeted out to them on October 3rd. And after that, I also sent a mail to them on October 18th. And uh, after that, I got a confirmation from NASA today morning. And uh, I was very elated to receive that email because uh, it was, uh, I was spending something like uh, eight to seven hours each day for four to five days on that. And after once I sent out, uh, sent out a tweet, I didn't do anything. Uh, I just stopped my search because I do know that this might be the probable debris and other debris might be just lying around uh, the same location. What you now see on your screens is the satellite image where the green dots indicate spacecraft debris and the blue dots show the disturbed soil, which could be the bits of the spacecraft. Subramanian analyzed many satellite images received from its orbiter over the course of three months. There has been no official response from the Indian Space Research Organization yet. So what exactly had happened? Let's break it down for you. India's second lunar exploration mission, Chandrayaan-2, took off on the 22nd of July. The Vikram lander attempted a soft landing around 600 kilometers from the south pole of the moon on the 7th of September. But shortly before the scheduled touchdown, the Indian Space Research Organization lost contact with the lander. On the 27th of September, NASA's orbiter camera team released the first mosaic to search for signs of Vikram lander. NASA had released two subsequent high-resolution images on 14th and 15th of October. Then, on the 11th of November last month, NASA's mosaic showed the impact crater and extensive debris field. Finally, on the 21st of November, just a couple of weeks ago, ISRO confirmed that the Vikram lander made a hard landing on the surface. Vikram lander's successful landing would have ushered India into an elite club of nations that have achieved soft lunar landings, such as the United States, China and the former Soviet Union. The mission was targeted to land on the far side of the moon, which is a largely unexplored region. The next phase now would have been a rover traveling on the lunar surface and collecting mineral and chemical samples for remote scientific analysis. But scientists say that the attempt itself was an achievement. It was only India's second moon mission and the first to attempt a lunar landing on a low budget too.